Hey y'all, it's Charlie. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you're new here, like I said, my name is Charlie and I am a Boston-based flight attendant. So today I'm gonna to be vlogging a little bit of my trip and I cannot wait for you guys to see. So today we have two legs. I'll put all the flights on the screen and I'll put all the aircraft information on the screen as well. I gotta finish getting ready, but I'll see y'all when I see y'all. goodness you guys I am so excited for this layover I'm gonna give you a quick hotel room tour don't even worry I already checked the room for bugs and thugs we're good oh this view is amazing this room is so cute ah, I can't even wait till I get undressed I have to show y'all now okay so this is what you see when you first walk in we're gonna take a peek into the bathroom the bathroom is nothing special but she will get the job done when you come out of the bathroom, you just see the closet. And of course, I'm gonna hang up my dress and everything. You guys know what a closet is. I don't know why I just tried to explain that. All of my crap is up there. So got a Keurig up here along with all of my crap, a microwave and mini fridge, never happens. And here is the actual room. Got two maybe full size beds. Got our TV over here, little sitting area so I can sit down and tell y'all about my flight. And here's the view, you guys. It is insane. Isn't that just the best view, even though it's of a parking lot? So this is like the small side. This isn't even the main beach. Isn't that crazy? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this layover. So I'm gonna change really quick and let y'all know how that flight went and then we're gonna go have some fun, honey. Okay, you guys, so I'm not naked. I know I look a little naked, I'm not naked. Okay, I'm wearing my hotel slippers, so yeah. Okay, so I really don't want to waste too much time sitting here talking about flight attendant stuff, even though I know it's a flight attendant vlog. But we only had two flights today. The first one was from Boston to Atlanta. Really smooth. It was pretty early in the morning. So all we did was knock out a service and sit down for a quick minute and then knocked out another service. It was very, very simple, smooth flight. Um, I was on an aircraft that I'd never been on before, so that was really interesting, especially since I was in the boarding position. So I was scared I was gonna have to like call for doors and all the stuff that the flight leader usually does, but he actually came up and did it, so I didn't have to do that either. Um, but yeah, seeing all these doors in real life is like crazy. <laughs> You're so used to just practicing on them. And as for the second flight of the day, it was cool too. It was really short. It was just from Atlanta to Pensacola and um, we did a water service and a snack service. So first we went through with like the bottled waters and passed them out to anybody who wanted them. And then after that, we went through with the choice of Biscoff cookies or Sun Chips and walked through with that just because it was so turbulent and it was already such a short flight that we had to do something and hurry up and sit back down. Cause by the time we got done with it, the pilots told us to sit down. So I'm glad that we were at least able to give them, you know, a little bit of something. <sighs> but all in all, good flights, great, great passengers all day. Super duper nice. Um, yeah, it's just been a great day. I'm about to go out and enjoy my layover. I am about to go read on the beach and might have to go buy a beach. I have a towel, so I might just buy an umbrella. I don't know because to rent the umbrellas downstairs, so crazy expensive, like over $20 an hour, which is insane. Or you can get it all day for 70. I'm not paying that, especially if we already, I didn't pay for the hotel, but you know what I mean? Like it should be included because technically this is a resort, so explain that to me but um I'm about to go down to the beach I might walk over to Alvin's Island and see if I can find me a um umbrella or something I'm gonna see if any of my friends want to come down and have some fun with me so let's hit it okay got all the essentials got plenty of water sunscreen a good book 
got my phone, my portable charger, I'm gonna take some cash, my beach towel, and might take a journal, might do some journaling. I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Found some umbrellas. it's charlie so i did not vlog that much yesterday um first off i'm in bozeman montana which i've never been to montana at all before and i just wanted to go ahead and add this vlog onto the last one because i did not vlog as much as i thought i was going to yesterday one of my friends came to see me and it was his birthday so i just wanted to spend some time with him and did not vlog like at all so <laughs> sorry about that but I am in Bozeman, Montana, and I had no intention of vlogging today, but since I didn't vlog much yesterday and seeing how beautiful Bozeman is, it's actually encouraged me to actually get out and go see some of it instead of just laying in bed like I planned to. So I'm thinking I might go hiking and I'm probably going to go downtown later on tonight like and get cute. It is Friday. I don't know like what the nightlife is here, but I do want to find something really, really good to eat. So we're gonna do a hike, then we're gonna go out. Pensacola was really fun, but this one's definitely gonna be a different vibe here in Montana. It is so beautiful coming in. It was, it was gorgeous. So I'm gonna give you a quick room tour. Actually, I'm not even gonna give you a full tour. I'm just gonna show you real quick because it is not, it ain't all that. But here's the room. And that was the room tour. <laughs> we got TV, microwave, fridge, all that. So that's good. I had, two flights today we had two flights today we went from pensacola to atlanta atlanta to bozeman montana and the last flight was about four hours long but it seemed a lot longer and we couldn't do a full service on a four hour flight because we had turbulence literally the whole entire time we just had a quick maybe 10 minutes where we didn't have turbulence every time we would get up to do every time we'd get up the captain would tell us to sit down and or we'd get up and then we'd hit turbulence and then he'd tell us to sit down it was just awful you guys but all in all the passengers were cool and um yeah i'm just loving life i'm loving my job i'm just so freaking happy so i'm gonna shower probably won't shower now probably no need to shower before i go on a hike but i'm gonna make myself look a little bit more decent um and rest up a little bit and catch the shuttle to the hiking location and then get ready to go out Okay guys, I'm literally glistening. I am ready to go hiking. Hopefully it's not too bad out there. I have my sunglasses and I have my hat, but it's over 90 degrees, so let's go though. So I just started and I saw a snake already and it was terrifying. My heart is beating out of my chest. But isn't it beautiful? <sighs> that was so scary. Definitely not where I'm supposed to be. I made it, you guys. I talk 
talked to a girl who's local here and she was just giving me some places that I should go next time I'm here and places to go for dinner. So I'm definitely gonna hit up some of those after I get back down this mountain and um, clean myself because I am quite literally filthy. I don't even know if you guys can see it. I've been trying to like clean myself up. I'm disgusting. My hat's gross. I literally just bought it yesterday. It's filthy, but I am really proud of myself. <laughs> So I didn't got to the top and that was the whole point. So where's the escalator to get me down? Elevator or something. Climb near a cliff. What am I doing? Oh, I got lost to say where I came from. Oh no. I'm about to go back up this mountain. Okay. So, not gonna lie. I got lost for like 30 minutes, but I found a sign that says the trailhead is this way and this all looks familiar so unfortunately I am out of water <sighs> and my mouth is not really producing any saliva right now <laughs> so if I die and someone finds this what's up y'all remember when I said I was going to do this hike and then I was going to go back to the hotel and clean myself and then go to downtown Bozeman. That's not happening. I'm about to go to the hotel. I'm going to clean myself and wait for my DoorDash to be delivered because I'm exhausted. Also, not that I have a problem with it, but I am at least seven shades darker than when I started this morning. <laughs> and I made it. Didn't die. but I am extremely thirsty. Good morning, you guys. I am in the process of getting ready. I have two flights today, because today is go home day, but this is the end of the vlog. I had two really fun layovers, one on the beach, one in the mountains. It was great. Um, today, I'm going back to Boston, and then I'm going on a layover with one of my friends, Morgan, who y'all met in my training vlogs, and I kind of talk about her a lot, I feel like. I'm not sure, but I sound like a frog. <laughs> I sound gross. It is um, not even four in the morning yet. We have a really early band. But thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed seeing my layovers. And I'm just really, really appreciative that I get to share this journey with y'all. So y'all have a blessed day and thanks for flying with me.